Hello, there were two main parts to Saturday's weather story, some heat and some thunderstorms. It was by quite some margin the hottest day of the year so far, 32 degrees Celsius in parts of Surrey, lots of other places not too far behind. But for some, that heat through the afternoon into the evening spawned some thunderstorms, a dramatic view for this weather watcher in Shropshire. This is how it looked on the radar picture through Saturday evening across parts of the Midlands, East Wales, Northwest England, and also up into Western Scotland. Some quite intense thunderstorms, a lot of rain falling in some locations and for Sunday well it's more of the same more hot sunshine but more scattered thunderstorms now uh, <laughs> it says here you don't need me to tell you that the UK has seen soaring temperatures this weekend it was the hottest day of the year so far yesterday an absolute oh. scorcher wasn't it? it certainly was the highest temperatures were seen in Surrey where it hit 32 degrees an amber heat alert remains in place in England and southern England and the Midlands until tomorrow morning. Those beach scenes look lovely, don't they? Oh, they do, don't they? Well, it is shaping up to be another beautiful day following the hottest day of the year it's so a scorcher. far. It's a scorcher. And you've been sharing your pictures with us this morning, so thank you for that. Should we take a look at them? Wow, mm. look at the, that. The only photo you would have got out of me from yesterday would have been a washing line full of washing because got loads of it done and dried in a day. It was brilliant. But this was from Gary Parrott. He's at Crawley Down in West Sussex. And this is this morning, Gary Morning, up bright and early. What a lovely start to the day down there. What an amazing, the amazing picture. And how about this uh, to wake up to? This is uh, Matt, who shared this from his morning walk across... Oh, sorry, Mike, across a uh, morning walk across the Aberdeen Beach. Apologies, Mike. Yeah, Beautiful nice picture. start to the day. Uh, Matt did send us this snap of his daughter, Kiwi, enjoying a splash in a stream yesterday. It looked like a, a lovely day where they were... Two, it was lovely everywhere. And it's going to be the same again today, Simon, isn't it? Not everywhere. No, no. Oh, because, not in, not actually, <laughs> you know, for some of us, we had thunderstorms. And I'll tell you, I got caught out in one of these thunderstorms yesterday and it was torrential. It was hot, it was sticky. You could feel it in the air. The wind picked up and then you had this almighty crack of thunder. I mean, it's some of the loudest thunder I think I've ever heard, actually, well, if yesterday. If you couldn't avoid it, there's no hope for the rest of it. I mean, and the rain was torrential. I mean, it just flooded everywhere really, really quickly, yeah. Right. So big thunderstorms around yesterday. That was just one of our weather pictures, weather, weather watcher pictures from Oswestry in uh, Shropshire. In fact, there were around about 3,000 lightning strikes yesterday as that heat built. We could see those lightning strikes across parts of the West Midlands into East Wales, North East Wales, up into northwestern parts of England. So that was through yesterday. And today we're going to see some thunderstorms as well. But yesterday was the hottest day of the year so far. 32.2 degrees Celsius in Chertsey in Surrey. We won't quite reach that 32 degrees today, but it's still going to be a hot day with some sunshine for most of us. But like yesterday, some thunderstorms kicking off as well. It's been a pretty uh, warm and muggy night. These are the temperatures out there at the moment, approaching 20 Celsius already in Manchester this morning, and with lots of clear skies this morning, that will translate into plenty of sunshine. Temperatures, well, not quite as high as yesterday across Scotland and Northern Ireland, but widely another hot day. And of course, UV levels will once again be high. Pollen also high, if not very high. Yes, well, yesterday, of course, we had lots of hot sunshine. It was the warmest day of the year so far, but there were also some pretty impressive thunderstorms across some parts of the UK as well. Uh, but this morning, it's been a lovely start to the day for many of us. Uh, this is just one scene this morning. That was in uh, Bedford. Thank you very much indeed for our weather watcher there. We've got a little bit of mist around coasts of uh, southwest England, south and west Wales as well this morning. But it was quite a sticky night for some of us. Is that mega busy this morning in Cornwall? It is. Yes, Fog. No. We yeah, seen absolutely. That for a while. So um, yesterday we had that hot and humid air, and that humidity around the coasts has led to a bit of fog this morning. Yeah, so uh, it's not been beautiful, sunny everywhere. Um, yeah, <laughs> looking very misty and foggy there, isn't it, at the moment? But away from the coastal areas, we have got some sunshine this morning. A beautiful start today here in Derbyshire. A few showers around parts of Scotland at the moment, but those will move their way a bit further northward. And during today, we're going to see again a case of hot sunshine, but the risk of thunderstorms, perhaps a greater chance you might catch a thunderstorm compared to yesterday. It's time to have a final look at the weather for this morning and um, go for it. Sun, rain, everything. Bit of everything, yeah. <laughs> Just like yesterday, many of us saw that sunshine. It was a hot day, the hottest day of the year so far. But for others, 
there were some torrential downpours. I experienced one of those, and I can tell you, I've never heard lightning uh, thunder as loud as that. So it's some awful rainfall through yesterday. But a lovely start this morning. Lots of blue skies and sunshine. It's already warming up out there. Temperatures up to about 20 degrees Celsius already. And again, temperatures 23 to 27 degrees Celsius. That hot weather uh, persisting for many of us. And well through into next week as well. Look at that. Lots of sunshine, lots of dry weather, temperatures for many in the mid to the high 20s, actually meeting heat wave uh, threshold um, values across many parts of the UK this week. And again, there is the risk of one or two showers here and there. That risk perhaps earlier on in the week compared to later in the week. But you can see the, uh, the dry, sunny weather continuing. Brilliant. So we were just talking, weren't we? Because mm. there's in your household, all the kids <laughs> taking their A levels yeah. and their GCSEs, all this really hot, humid weather. It's not great, is it? It's not great, exams. is it? So no. not, good, not good for revision. <laughs> no. Oh, no, but I'm revising outside, honestly. No, you're not. <laughs> 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 anyway, thanks, though. Not a lot of work being done.